Well, that is a good first drive. Holy smoke. Rip that. Welcome back to every shot of a 12 handicappers round. Today we are at the Hertfordshire Golf and Country Club, my home course. Bit of a jumbled set of holes today. We're going to be playing off 12 to start because the senior swindle just went off. I actually tried to record this video yesterday, got stuck behind a four ball and it took me two hours to get around five holes. So I was like, that can't happen today. So we're starting off on 12 and then we'll go loop back around and play the first 11 holes once we finish these ones. Hopefully today we can go low. This is a relatively easy hole to start, so we're not far away. Let's get it on the green. Let's two putt, let's get a par, maybe even a birdie. We've got 72 yards to the pin here. Let's see if we can put this one close. All right, that's a bit right. <laughs> is it? Okay, we are putting. It's nowhere near, but we are putting. We've got about 50 foot to the pin here. Let's see if we can get this anywhere close. That looks good, it might even go in. Go on. Oh, wiggled right at the end. Wow, decent bowl there. Start off with a par. Now, despite it being the end of July while we're recording, it's still wet and horrible. I just don't really understand what's going on in the UK right now. Where is the sun? It was blindingly hot yesterday, but muggy. And today, well, it's just windy and cloudy with a bit of rain happening. Now, we usually try and play somewhere different every single week, but I'm actually on the no-fly list. That means no leaving the vicinity of my house to go anything more than like half an hour away because my wife is literally ready to drop our second child at any moment. She is full term and uh, yeah, we're expecting her any time now. By the time you're watching this, she'll have been born. So I'm now the two time. I now have two daughters, which is absolutely fantastic. But until that happens, I can't go anywhere because I need to be able to get home and take her to the hospital if she goes into labor. So our exotic golf trips will return, but just later in the season. Now what's strange about starting on 12 is 13 through 18 are probably the most challenging holes on the course. Um, so it's gonna be interesting to play it in reverse order and have some easier holes coming in. Uh, this is an especially tricky hole. Uh, you have to get your drive right if you want any chance of having an approach into the green. just the guy with the mowers down there, so I'm shouting for him. Hopefully, didn't go near him. Right, so this is what I was talking about. If you are anywhere, but right in the middle of the fairway, you are blocked out, so it's just gonna be a chip out this one. That's not very good, but it should just about get as far enough out. All right, I've got 79 yards to the pin here. That's pretty good. I'm thinking that might just about be pin high, hopefully. One, two, three, four and a half. All right, it's definitely breaking a little bit in there. Got about 15 foot here for par. See if we can roll in. Just need a confident one, I think. Oh, close. Ah, oh, you melt Tom. Oh, double, damn, 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 damn. That is so poor. That's a frustrating double. Just wanted to make the par too badly and shot it past to an uncomfortable length. It is what it is, one of those things I've just got to remember. All right, another tricky hole here. It's a relatively long par four, pond on the right, which we have to avoid. It's kind of in driving range, so we're into wind. I don't know if I can get there today. That's not going in the pond. It might end up in the bunker on the left, though. Sit. All right, it's missed the bunker. It's passed it on the left. All right got like 167 to the pin here. I don't feel like I can comfortably hit a club that will get me there. So I'm going to be really safe here, hit an eight iron and just try and make sure it gets moving up there. Oh my God. Well, that is dreadful guys. Well, at least we're on the fairway. Third shot here. Uh, we've got 125 to the pin. Ah, uh, oh, wind might be helping me. I thought that was going to go miles to the left. I think we might be putting. I thought for a second there we were ending up in the long rough on the left. Right, we need some objectives for today. So the objectives, I do like to try and make birdies. So we're gonna try and make DOS birdies today. That would be pretty good. We're gonna try and get, I think today I might need to get up and down a few times. So I'm gonna say, I'm gonna try and get two up and downs. Now I have broken 80 here before. It's a past 70 course, but I don't fancy putting the pressure on myself to try and score low 
don't think that really is conducive for low scoring. So I'm gonna go with ball hunting objective. We gotta find two golf balls. I absolutely love finding golf balls out on the golf course. It's just like a guilty pleasure of mine. Let me know if you're the same. We gotta find two today. Got about 35 foot here for a uh, par. I think it's unlikely, but it's gonna turn a bit. I just have not given that what it needed. My God, we're on potential double bogey alert here. Oh, how have I missed? Oh, that's so bad. Double bogeys back to back. But I did say that this is one of the hardest sections of the course. Very easy to put doubles on the card here. Wish I wasn't, but yeah. Let's see how we can get on and recover for the rest of the round. Best hole on the course, it's the signature hole. It's number 15, our fourth of the video. Downhill par three over water. Pins about 165 yards away. See if we can stick this one close, eh? So on the flag, that is gonna be very close. Oh my goodness me. I got very lucky there. I did catch it a hair thin, so it's only just made it. Right, okay, we're not leaving ourselves with the best chances here. <clears throat> We've got a 45 footer up the hill. <gasps> oh, I had a chance. Oh, it's gone that dodgy distance pass. I've got a downhill putt now. I have to literally tap this to get it to go anywhere near the hole. Go on. Yes. Little dripper for you there, boys and girls. Don't mind that. Get back on the par train. We're four over through four. It's not the worst through that section of holes. So let's see if we can do some damage going forwards. Next up, we have the hardest hole on the course, guys. Um, so, fingers crossed. It's, all it is is just long. There's no real skill to this one. Oh, that is such a good drive. That's the best drive I've ever hit on this hole by a mile. Go. Yeah, that's gone a long, long way. Come on, baby. I think that one's probably caught the wind a bit because uh, I think it's got like 290, which it doesn't usually. So, we've now got... 140 into this pin, it's a little downwind. Oh, I've pulled it left. Avoid that bunker, please. Clear it. No. Oh, we're on the green. I think this was way too much club, to be fair. The wind has just absolutely flown that miles. It's roughly 50 foot to the pin today. It's like our favorite distance. That's not gonna get there, I don't think. Go ball. Or maybe it will. Maybe it'll go in. Or maybe it'll just be another tap in. Let's go, baby. There we go. Cool, another par. That's a really good hole to par, I won't lie. All right, we've got a par five now. It's not really ever a two shot hole, uh, especially when you're playing it into wind like I am today. So, let's get a driver down there. Pulled it a little bit. Hopefully it doesn't go in that bunker on the left. No, we're fine. Yeah, we'll take that. We'll take that. You can kind of see why you can't go for it now because I've got 250. That was a good drive for me. I'm happy with that. Um, but it's just so far and you get no benefit because there's a pond at the bottom. So even though I was uh, hitting a, a three wood and just clearing the water, it's like the biggest danger of play for not much gain. So nine iron lay up down the hill, leave ourselves a short iron in for the approach. Yeah, that'll do. Oh, oh, flirting, maybe, maybe a little bit, laid it up a little bit too close to the water there. Guys, bull hunters, we've got a, oh, this is decent. I thought it was gonna be rubbish because it's yellow, but it's actually a Srixen AD33. So they're premium ball. So that's one of our two balls checked off our uh, objectives. Oh, there's another ball. What's that? Oh my goodness me. It's AD33 territory. This time it's a white one. Check that out. So we have actually found two. Um, I'll see if I can find some more though. Like maybe if we could find a Pro V1, that'd be like an absolute bonus, a little Brucey bonus. The only problem with it being wet is that I've now walked through some long grass and my socks are soaked. So, good stuff. Saying 121 playing 123 to the pin, but we're into wind, so I'm going to hit a 9 iron. I haven't got the best lie here. In fact, I'm actually sitting in a bit of a tough. That's a bit frustrating. Yep, and that is, exactly, that is a really good strike. It might be too good now. Is it? Oh, we're putting. This is such, a, you know what? This is my like card ruin a hole. Get to 17 and then make like a quad bogey. It's happened so many times. 
So happy just to be on the green there. One, two, three, four, nine, ten, eleven. Right, about 35 foot to the pin here. We have to come up quite an aggressive shelf though. So should come round to my left, your right, guys. Oh, it's taking the slope too much. Don't do this to me. No, oh, I've got a really, really hard putt now. I pulled it. So bad. That was awful, that part, by the way. In fact, both were. Oh, that's a bogey. I could have got the monkey off my back with that one. I hate this hole and I could have parred it or even birdied it. Oh, this is a lovely hole. Quite tricky from the back tees. It's 182 yards to the pin. I have got a six iron in hand. Going to give it a bit of space. Going to aim over to the left. If I was actually five over coming into the 18th hole, I'd be... Well, I'd be absolutely overjoyed because I'd be setting a new PB here today. Oh, I caught it thin. Got to go. It's got to go. Go! Right, we're in the bunkers at the front of the hole. Uh, I've not got myself the best lie here. Oh my God, I'm like a mountain goat right now. All right, just make sure that we hit the ground first or the sand first. Oh, sometimes the unlucky breaks are the worst in golf. There we go. I could go in. Oh, so close. I missed it. Oh, I've pushed every single putt from that range today. Ah, oh, so frustrating. Oh, that's a double to finish off 18 there and puts us to seven over. Oh man. However, we can make some shots up on the front. Like the front is so much easier. So there's no reason why we couldn't actually shoot our handicap today. So <laughs> we're now on the first. Um, we are straight into a hella breeze right now. I cannot believe it's so windy. Mental. Gonna try and give that tree a wide berth for sure. On the left, it's the one that always blocks you out. Well, that is well hit, <laughs> very well hit, but it's on the uh, on the fairway for the uh, the night. So yeah, so we've got 170 into the breeze now. Um, the pin is at the front. I am gonna take a five iron. It's way too much club, but because of the angle I'm coming in at, I think I'm gonna hit the rough rather than the apron. So it's going to slow it down quite a bit. Turn. Turn for me, ball. All right, I think it was pretty much exactly the right club. I think it's going to be perfectly pin high. It's just, you know, 30 yards right. <laughs> However, it does give us a chance for an up and down here. So let's go get it. Let's get it. It's a shame that our putter is dead cold today because otherwise we'd actually be scoring really well. Seven over through those holes isn't too bad, but realistically there were four. I think I counted putts that were really, really makeable, like should be making at least half of them, which would have made us, you know, two to three shots better. About 13 yards. I think I've got to pitch it in the fringe and let it roll out. Just got to make sure that I don't <laughs> not get it through, you know? That's pretty much exactly what I wanted to do. Yeah, happy with that. Chance of it up and down. This has to go in. This will go in. This is 100% going in. 100% going in. 100% going in. Yes, come on, an up and down, a par to start the round <laughs> in some ways. Let's get on to number two, slash. Does that make it? Like number nine? I don't know. This is actually a sneaky hard hole. It's a par four at dog legs to the left. You don't want to try and take anything off though because it will bite you in the ass as you'll go out of bounds. It's so strange. The uh, out bounds kind of cuts in on it. So, I'm gonna hit driver here. Yep, that will play my friends. That will very much play. I mean, it's gone nowhere. The wind is howling now. What is July doing to us? 160 to this pin, but the wind is kind of like a bit blowing a bit, I won't lie. Uh, so I'm going to try and bring it in left of the pin, so the front edge, because there's a bunker right of the pin, so I don't want to mess around with that. That's not going to do it, is it? That is an absolute garbage shot. All right, it was trash. It's just another opportunity to go up and down though, isn't it? 
We need them up and down for the checklist. We've got 66 yards, wind's in two. Coming out the rough. That could be really good. Yeah, I think that we've got a chance there. It's, it's not gonna be like a, a makeable chance, but it, there's an outside chance. Right, 30 foot, slightly uphill. Ooh, slow down now. Oh, I've given myself that nervy distance. I feel like these putts are the difference between great rounds and crap rounds at my level of golf. Just making these types of putts really is the difference. Yeah, okay, we made that one, thank God. <laughs> we finally converted like a five footer into a putt. Very nice. All right, okay, chance to make some shots back. This is the easiest section of the course, the next four holes. So let's try and make it count. We've got a short par five. Let's just make sure we hit a good one up there. Our driver has been performing pretty well so far today, bar a couple of pushes. Oh, and it continues to perform. Go on. Yep, yep, yep. That is big. Come on. All right, decent drive. We've got 189 left on this par five. Got five iron. That could be good. Get good bounce. Oh my God. That's right at it. That is right at it. Guys, I can't see it, but that was literally trickling straight at the pin there. Surely there's no way. Don't even think about it, Tom. Don't even think about it. Don't. I'm thinking about it. I'm just gonna keep the camera on. Not because I think it's in the hole. Not because I think it's in the hole and there's a chance that we need to make sure that there's no chops or anything. Oh, it's not. It's close though, we've got an eagle putt. Holy smokes. I won't lie, that had to have scared the hole. It came in, it was cutting, it was turning. I saw it aim straight at the pin and we can't be more than 15 foot away right now. Oh my Lord. Woo! I want one really good roll. It's a tricky pin position. One, two, three, four, five. It's gonna break down to the left the whole way. 15 foot for a second eagle on the channel. I do think it's gonna break quite a bit. It's weird. Doesn't look like it breaks that much, but it's sneaky. You've got to get it to the hole. Oh, oh my God. Oh, that would be so nice. Imagine if we made an albatross. That would have been different gravy. That really would have been, but it's a birdie. That's our first birdie which is great. So that means that we are now back to seven over. That's really nice. This is a tricky par three, this one downhill, about 175 to the pin. Uh, I've got a six iron in hand, just because I find that like, it always just feels like it plays a bit longer than it is. Oh, I pulled it. Oh, actually it stopped turning. That could be really good. Oh my God, it was just short. I think it's just about roll past pin eye. Come on. All right, 27 foot birdie attempt here. Hit that too hard unless it goes in. No way. <laughs> I mean, I should be thankful. I really, really should be thanking my lucky stars that that's hit the hole and stopped. But I'm equally like, oh man, it would be sick to have back-to-back -back birdies on the channel. But it is a tap in par. So we'll take it. Oh man, you always think, oh, that should have gone in. But really, if I got the weight right, it would have gone low and you know, whatever. Next up, we have got a par five. It's again short, but the wind has actually switched since we started and now it's interface. Now don't take this the wrong way because I love how inclusive golf can be. Like I love that juniors can get out. I love that people my age can get out. I love that people of senior age can get out. This is, just, this is just an observation. So I teed off on the 12th when the third of, I think, six tee times for the seniors had gone off the first. So I played 12 through 18, and now I've played, and I've now catched them. <laughs> um, so yeah, my guy George in the pro shop was like, it will be like a five hour round for them. Thankfully, obviously I'm not going to play all the way around. So. 
Oh, oh. That is so bad. Um, hybrid to the rescue, I guess, or hopefully. Yep, hybrid to the rescue. Clear all those trees, please. Hopefully it hasn't come down behind the trees. Hopefully we're all right there. All right, we've got 158 playing 155 for this pin, but the wind is all over the shop. So a seven iron in hand just because we're playing into wind. Oh, I've chopped it out. Sit, sit short of the bunker. I mean, it's GIR, so I don't even know why I'm shouting for that. But there you go, we're in. Free relief, free relief. The chant of a mid-handicap golfer that is. We love a GUR bunker. <clears throat> free relief. Boop. I think. I think if I chip it onto the the down slope, it's going to carry it most of the way out. That's perfect. Oh, bad kick. Sent it left instead of right. It's all sort of like aiming that way. Chance for an up and down and a pass save here. All right, 24 foot here, slightly downhill. Turn. Oh, that was so close. I read it right as well, just maybe slightly over read it. Okay, bogey it is. All right, on to the next. Putting's definitely got more dialed since we turned onto the, uh, the front nine. A very friendly par three, however, the pin is right at the back. 150 yards to the pin. Wind, I think, is helping just a little bit. Wind's got to help that a lot because I caught it just like with an open face, so it's going to be short. Yeah. It's on though, we're putting. Can't complain with that. All right, we now have a 60 footer up the hill. The pin is about three yards on, and there's a slope behind it. Someone was not happy this morning when. They set up the pin locations, that's for sure. Slow down now. Wow, I've clarted that. 12 footer, here we go. Ah, oh, damn, wasn't far away. Pick up a bogey for our troubles. On to the next. This is a hole where it either goes dreadfully wrong or really right. There's no real in between, so. Yeah, let's see if we can get it really right today, eh? Oh no, hold, hold. Oh, we're in trouble. Oh, we're gonna have to chip out. I saw a ball hunter, guys. What's that doing there? Oh my god, oh, it's a, f oh, I thought it was, I thought it was a Pro V1. It was so white and shiny. It turns out to be a bloody Slazenger. Here's the situation, guys. Flag is behind the tree on the right. We can go up and over, the green is quite long and goes diagonally that way. However, there is a water hazard that runs all the way in front. The ball's beneath my feet, so it's gonna come out and right. Also, the wind's pushing that way. I'm not sure this is a good idea, but we are gonna give it a go. Because on YouTube, the first rule of YouTube is that I must send it. Oh no, I uh, just caught it a little thin, never got it off the ground, that's a shame. This is as equally a stupid shot, guys. The plan is, low lofted club, chip it, hit it into the bank, and have it roll up onto the ledge for a par putt. You are actually a psycho, mate. You are a psycho. Yeah, I mean, that's not done. <laughs> oh my God. How has that got through those trees? We are actually somehow putting for a par? That's wild. <laughs> I don't very often get the 90% air, but somehow it's managed to go pass through all of this. I mean, riddle me that. This really would be the most ridiculous par of my entire life. Oh, don't hit the flag. Okay, didn't hit the flag. We're definitely not getting there. <laughs> we make our bogey somehow. We could take that from that position for sure. You join me at my least favorite hole on the entire golf course. Narrow, long. Out of bounds left, dead right. It's just what you don't want. Kick it out. Oh, it got kicked out. Dun 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 dun. It got kicked out. Dun 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 dun. Thank you, tree. Our ball is here. The green is there. 
but we've got to wait. So let's go bull hunting. This is definitely a good spot, but there is a river down there, so I've got to watch my feet. Ah, oh, I stung myself. But I bought, I bought. Oh, it, no, fuck, no way. As if there's a range ball about, about a kilometre away from the driving range. Do we jump across the river and go in deeper? Well, that's a silly question, of course we do. This is like the Sidemen hide and seek on an island, this is. Oh, it's much deeper though. They would never find me in my hiding spot. Oh, there's a ball. Oh my God, it's tightless. Oh, oh baby. Oh baby, I should have brought a club. Oh baby, oh baby, it's a Pro V1. Oh, cha-ching, money. Oh, there's another one. What's that? Ooh, Tiger Woods, eat your heart out, little Bridgestone. Oh, and another, oh, that might be another tight list. Oh, this is the best spot ever. There's loads. Oh, so many stinging nettles. What are they all here for? My legs. What's that? Oh, it's another Pro V1. Come on. What's that one over there? Oh, that's one of them new Callaway design balls. Yeah, we'll take that one too. Oh, another ball. Oh, it's another tight list. Oh, no, is that, oh, I think. Wait, is that Pro V1? They've coloured it out, I can't tell. I had to abandon ship, I think it's time to hit the ball and also my legs have now been stung to pieces, but I mean, couple of Pro V1s, you're not gonna say no, are ya? Right, regardless of how lucky we got, this is still an absolute pig of a shot. 179 yards in. It's a long bloody way, I won't lie. I got so excited to try and smash it. And that is exactly why. Anytime I try and hit the ball too hard, that's what happens. Fortunately, we've rolled short of the bunker. Good layup. I think like 99% of the time, this is a five shot hole for me anyway. So I'm not too disappointed with that. I think I'm gonna take a 54 and go pretty much full at this one. That looks pretty good. Should be on the green. Yep, safely aboard. Two part bogey, that's what I'm looking for here. Gonna hit this one like it's the 30 footer, I think. I have pulled that something rotten. Weight wasn't too bad, but I've actually given myself a hell of a putt here. Oh, just dripped in, come on. We will take a bogey on that hole every day of the week. Okay, chance to make a shot back here on a relatively easy par four. Didn't catch all of it, but it should run. Oh yeah, it's taking a really good bounce. Just running and running and running. We'll take that all day long. Here's the score, guys. Got 125 to a back stick. It is downwind. I have got a 50 degree in hand here. That's pretty good. Give it a push wind. Go, go. Oh, oh, it's a little bit short, but that's kind of what we were playing for. So we got to take that as a dub. In hindsight, I should have taken pitching wedge, but you know, you live and learn. Got uh, about 55, 60 foot for 30 here. Oh, that's coming in nicely. Oh my God, go in. Oh, I was so close. These are the ones we were having problems with at the start, but I feel like those problems have left us, so. Nice. A par, we're 11 over, two to play. One over, we'll shoot our handicap, par out could be our handicap, let's see if we can go par out. Nice hole this one, um, as long as you get your tee shot away and into the fairway, you've got a good chance of you know, hitting the green in two because it's not that long. Um, got a hybrid because driver is just not the play on this one, it really is not. Oh, I've absolutely creamed that. Hopefully it's not gonna get close to these guys. No, we're fine, we're in the fairway. Absolutely perfect. I got that coming out at 139 yards, playing 142, but I'm gonna hit, I think maybe even two clubs more. I might hit seven here. Oh, I've caught it thin. Please get lucky. All right, I think we might just be putting or we're on the left hand rough. Right, I feel like we need to make this putt for birdie if we wanna complete that objective. I think I've pushed that. Oh my God, it's going so fast. Stop, stop. Just a strong, confident roll here, Tom. That's the one we wanted. It's a par, baby. Last hole, just need to par it to uh, 
beat our handicap today. Currently 11 over, handicap 12. So wind strong off the right. The par three about 180 yards long. That's gonna have to run a long way. Okay, it's bounced the right way. It's on the green. Slow down now. I think it's gonna go off the back. How can such a bad strike result in it going so blooming long? I basically fatted it. Hi babe, can you tell me what you just told me in your text message? Yeah, the contractions have started. I think you should probably come home. I think the baby's coming. <laughs> can I um can I finish this golf hole? Would that be all right? What do you think? Um I'll be quick. All right, I'll see you I'll see you at home soon. All right, bye-bye. Okay, love you. Bye, love you. All right, guys, we've set up for the amazing finale. The baby's on the way. I'm going straight to meet my wife been waiting for weeks for this so very very excited maybe we can finish this with the ultimate if we chip in we'll finish the up and downs and we'll also make our second birdie and check off all the objectives i don't think it's going to happen but oh my heart's going a million miles a set an hour here oh there's a chance please oh my god we were so close all right quick 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 finish off finish off finish off Oh, almost missed. I'm all of a jitter, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed. Baby's on the way. I'll see you later. If you want to see another video from me, click right here. Bye-bye.